Hello everyone, welcome back to another Adobe Premiere Pro tutorial. In this one, I'm going to show you how to do this simulated earthquake or hard camera shake effect. You'll see it in a lot of movies, especially in sci-fi movies with glitches. How did I do it? Let me show you. It'll take about 35, 40 seconds. Here we go. Drag and drop your footage into the timeline like I've done here. Make sure your playhead's at the beginning. Go to your effects panel. If you don't see it, go to window. Make sure there's a check mark beside effects. In the search bar, type in the word wave. W-A-V-E warp. This is the effect we're going for. It's under wave, video effects, distort, wave warp. Drop it onto the footage, and then you get some default settings, none of which are correct for what we're looking for. So let's go through them. First off, wave type, switch it from sine to smooth noise. This is a smooth uh, type effect. We want to take our wave height down from 10. We want to drop that to about, well, let's go, actually, we're going to increase that to 100. Pardon me. We're going to drop the wave width down quite a bit, though, so just stay with me. Wave whip starts at 40, take it down to 1. Direction from 90 degrees, we're taking it down to 0 degrees. Wave speed, take it up to 2. Yeah, around 2. 2 should work. And then everything else should be okay. Let's hit spacebar, see what we got. There you go. We've got a earthquake simulated effect. If you want more wave height or if you want more width, you can go ahead and adjust them as you see fit. Finally, you can also increase the scale under motion to about 104%, only because if you don't do that, you'll see some slight fuzzy blurring on the edges, which might show up as black in the final copy.